Yes, we have to talk. Oh. Hmm. Because you know, yeah, Tega has finally come to reveal to us why she has been doing things with Boma under the doorway. And I'm just like, ah, when I say don't go to Bibi Niger house with strategy, they will not listen to me. I have just on Tega. I have just on course. Oh my gosh, my cross. Sasuke is doing cross shaggy. Sasuke is playing with cross his heart. Oh, we have just on cross and Sasuke. And we have just also on Tega and Boma. Oh. Cross your leg, get ready for this sweet one. My name is Omi Odike Wachiko. Let's talk to your homie TV. Out here, I give sweet and juicy juice. And guys, we have a target to get to 50k subscribers before the end of September. Big ups, we're on 43,000. Yay! We have to get to 50k, guys. Please, if you're watching this video and you're not subscribed to my channel, please go and click the subscribe button. I'm just going to stop. Go and subscribe, go and click. You get me? Have you done it? Have you done it? Thank you very much. Give me thumbs up because thumbs up helps videos grow. Yeah, so I want to start talking about curse now. What happened? And hmm. um, they were all on the table now, they were just in curse, angel, um, um, queen, and all. Yeah, and so they were just now. And I think curse was joking with angel, Sha, and then boom, um, Perry now comes like right now. Perry and angel they call themselves my wife, my husband. I don't know if it's joke or I don't get you. Get me? Then uh, Perry and I say, Eh, my wife, what are you doing there? Say nothing. Oh, I come now. That's how Perry now went close to Angel. What did I now see? Perry is kissing Angel. I mean, not French kiss, you get me, but like lip to lip peck or whatever you call it, you get me? For like three times now. Like, ah, ah, yeah? Cause look, say, wait, when did all this start? I'm like, are you joking? Angel, I like you. Angel was like, Baba, you don't like me. Sasuke, you like. And of course, now came and told him, Angel, that see, I don't like Sasuke. Angel was like, what? Well, Sasuke said that he used to like Sasuke romantically before, but right now he doesn't like do messy things. So he doesn't like Sasuke anymore. And let me tell you why he said that. Hmm, interesting. So what happened now was that last night, in fact, Cross and Sasuke have been having issues here. Cross likes Sasuke, obviously, but J Paul also likes Sasuke, and I love how J Paul is playing it. He's playing it cool and easy, but he's getting really close to Sasuke's heart. They are hanging out together like almost every time, to the extent that if Cross wants to talk to Sasuke, he will literally have to come to meet them together and talk to Sasuke. Do you get me? So he's tired now, but she's telling him, like, oh, if you want to, if you want me, man, come closer to me. She was giving this juice to peace here. Come on, meet me. Come that to me. Do you understand? Talk to me and thing now. And so last night, um, they were all sitting down together. J Paul now made food, now brought it to Sasuke. Um, if you see the way Cross looked at Sasuke, if you see the look he gave Sasuke here, yeah, he got up and he left. Like he was so angry. Um, uh, me right now, yeah. I really rather J Paul. What is even rather? <laughs> well, let them try to do what they are doing, Sha. Let Cross get his head intact. Cause right now it looks like it's the house. Everybody now, they're almost all paired up literally almost all of them are all paired up you get me so that's cross yeah and sasuke what do you guys think should cross focus on his game and leave sasuke alone or do you think that there might still be like something in future for them let me know in the words in the comment section my darling now let's get to tega and boma gosh guys how has tega and boma now become this unit that discusses queen in laws like how they were outside this morning in the garden talking about queen Tega was telling Queen um, Boma that, ah, that can you imagine that there was one day at night though, lights out though. Tega just came and said, ah, Boma, where are you going to? Ah, the Queen was like, eh, wait, 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 ah. Like, even her, she was like, calm down now. She was like, no, 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 that, ah, she told Boma to go and sleep now. That, why is no on his bed? Why is no on his bed? Ah, Tega was like, oh, more. Boma was like, I better leave that girl alone. That girl was just annoying. That um, the girl, they chose, I don't want to try to complain about Queen, Sha. Next one, they now moved to how, in the house, they play this game, question game, yeah. So imagine me, you, and somebody else, right? I would ask you, Tope, why did you kiss Boma last night? You will not act on that person. Bimpe, why did you for um no not for? Basically, you will not answer me. You ask somebody else a question. If you answer me, then you're lost, you've lost the game. You have to come and drink like the alcohol and do it, then all that thing, yeah. Now, in that whole game, Pere said something to Tega. Um, Tega, why did you allow Boma to straff you two nights ago? She gets another person also said to, to boma why did you um suck tega's nips two nights ago do you understand now queen now now listen you know tega is telling this to boma oh. queen thinking she's helping a fellow woman now comes to meet tega and say ah tega you should have cleared that thing that perez said though during that game because how can perez say uh why did you allow boma straff you do you understand and you allow that thing go like that tega was like ah that was a business it's a game queen is like oh that's see you and boma was upstairs with um angel Boma and Angel they kissed, and Boma told Angel not to tell anybody what happened. But Boma still went to go and tell Pere that they kissed, that she that he kissed um, Angel. So 
Queen is now advising this girl that so that so that nobody now thinks that it is true. You should have corrected Peril. Buma was like, eh? Haha, <laughs> very funny. That's eh, uh, is anybody strap that begged you? That girl can do like a 12 that's queen. Can do like a 12 year old girl. What is that? The girl was like, ah, uh -uh, that she was wondering you know, because it's a game, and I mean, even if her and Buma strap and Buma tells anybody because she was telling this to Queen. It's Boma that is being stupid because he's the one carrying gist. I'm just like, oh, Sega. And now I've been hearing gist. I did not watch this one, but I've been hearing gist that Boma actually, if, if you watch this one, confirm in the comment section. That Boma told the guys, them, that Tega's Puna smells like fish. Oh, gosh. Oh, God. If Tega comes outside this house and just sees all these things that's happening, won't she just start to cry? Won't she just cry? And she was really arguing you know, that can you imagine that queen girl is acting very immature. That was that mom was like, I've told you now that that's why you know he had to leave her alone. That like, can you imagine why money keeps coming to meet him to talk to him to talk to a queen? That is it by force, does not want to talk to queen now. That I am just like ah when two enemies just gather together because see, really and truly, I remember when Tega and Boma like when they started to talk a lot yeah Tega was really talking to boma like for queen you know that queen is a nice girl you know go to queen now that we have now started to see that things have been happening under the duvet suddenly now it feels, it feels like Tega now hates queen i'm like how where did all this come from <laughs> let me tell you guys why i didn't tell you guys earlier yeah there was a day that Tega, the corros and some people shadow on the on the bed outside talking and Tega was like ah that somebody asked her that what if she leaves this house and her husband says that doesn't want to do this marriage again she said that ah now she get the fame now she gets the money now she get everything again she will move on with her life now we think consign them so maybe in that girl's head like we might have sweet time they can you call call and I, I also want to make a make a case eh for anybody who is thinking that oh why should they marry you might go to be in nigeria it's not by you being married it's by the individual i must state this now it's by the individual because let me tell you guys something we have seen a case of a lady delish stay in the house nobody even did anything to her at all at all because she had a boyfriend at the house she kept on saying i have a boyfriend i have a boyfriend there was never a case of oh maybe toilet somebody was zipping somebody she was as plain as plain can be and she won the won the money you get so it's by your values also i've seen cases of guys of like a married man in the house and did not frolic with any lady at all and he stayed till final day he was even top two we have also seen a case of a married man who was in that baby ninja house do you get me who was married and lied that he was not married and was doing things with a girl in the house so basically like it's not about married women or married women it is really about the individual do you get me let me just clear the air right now tega is doing what she's doing because she's tega don't use tega's own to now say oh why should married women go into the house it is about the individual and let's move to why tega actually thinks it is good to do what she's doing and do it so they're having this um kindness day in the house here yeah, where you know it like half me have to pair together and just talk to one another about like just get to know yourselves really and so Tega is with Cross. And they're talking about different things in the house. And Tega says that ah, she's, ah, she's a lover. Cross was like, ah, you like love and you're literally the one that goes up and down to cause Wahala. You are putting, you are just trying to cause Wahala between ships. Tega is like, eh, because she feels like they should know what you're doing already. That this is a show. Do you understand? And that the reason for this show is to cause drama. Do you get? So, like, people should be wondering, ah, under the duvet things, what's happening under the duvet. That if you're not doing all those things, that you're not making the show interesting. Because the show was created for content. All those under the duvet kind of content. I'm like, okay. Now I see why she's doing what she's doing with Boma. Even cause I have to say, like, but Tega, you're not big sister. Like, how do you know what they need? Like, how do you know what, what like, producers want? So that she's telling Cross now that she has been in something like this before and she knows that they want drama. So obviously that now explains why she's doing all the things with Boma. She thinks she thinks we are enjoying it too. She thinks she's giving us content too. You know, yeah. I, you know why I like this show? Because nobody should ever go to be in Nigeria with any strategy. I say this a lot. Nobody wants to believe me. Even though white money is playing the game well, let's not even let's not even joke. But don't go with because because each year, each season. You don't know what people are looking for. You don't know what you will do that will make us happy and make us sad. Because, I, bruh, all the comments I've been seeing about this Tega P is smelling comments, baba. It's all smelling comments. And to think that somewhere in her head, she kind of thinks that 
that content maybe of course she watched she has been watching all the shows and has seen how people behave and probably has watched a whole season where there was a particular lady who did all the under the duvet movement and the lady had strong fan base maybe she now thinks that ah okay let her now come and do duvet thing maybe that's how she will get fan base just look at it now no just just really just look at the whole pain now what do you guys think oh eh what do you have to say about the matter even cause try to even explain to her like maybe you don't know what they're looking for she says see now this show is called shine your eyes you're supposed to shine your imagine now you now you tega be the producer now you be is her what's your opinion Sha? that's the gist for today oh tega and boma talking about queen waiting and the funny thing is that they don't even know that they are helping this queen girl they don't know they don't know that all this gossip is helping queen's game well because i've seen people in the comments when i post these videos and by the way all the videos are on my instagram page talk to your homie tv you can go and watch everything there you know when i post the videos there i see comments and people say ah let me go and vote queen the more you talk about somebody the more people now want to now prove to you that that person is actually like stronger and they don't even know many asha they will get evicted that be they will come out they will see what they want to see Life will move on. You get me? Exactly. Don't forget, guys, I have a target to get to 50,000 subscribers before the end of September. Do this for me. If you watch this point in time, please subscribe to my channel. Go and click the button. I'll appreciate it here. And give me thumbs up. And I also have a vlog channel. You can talk to your homie vlog there. I show you guys my life or what I do behind the scene. If you like all these like day in the life content week in the life content we will love my vlog channel it's called talk to your homie vlog it's only on youtube my darling i'll put a link down below to my latest vlog go there click key and watch it you will love me i know you will love it yeah also i have a channel hmm. this one here eh? if your life is not moving forward literally like if you're stuck you know that you have everything that should make your life go like you're smart you're good you're good at you're good but opportunities are not coming your way it feels like the sky and the air is just blocked around you please do yourself a favor i have the answer for you it's on pennywise yeah i'll put a link down below to my youtube channel go there click it watch one video you will love it i'm telling you on that note i'll say peace out my darling thank you for watching my video give me a kiss in the comments just, just be nice to me joe in the comment section eh Mwah. bye bye